It's time for Reverend Al's Prompter Tips. Senator Ted Cruz gave his own State of the Union response last night, and it didn't go so well. And yet today, median incomes have stagnated for over a decade. Tonight, America saw a powerful demonstration. Senator Cruz had a little trouble with the speech, but don't worry, Senator, trust me, it happens. We all know I've had my share of prompter issues, right, Keenan? Republicans are mad because the Tea Party has been targeted by the herds. I'm sorry, what? Excuse me, the IRS. All Republicans want to do is spout conspiracy the old rise. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, excuse me. Conspiracy theories. <laughs> That's enough of that. So, Senator Cruz, let me offer some help, some teleprompter tips. Tip number one, take it in stride. Mistakes happen, but it's always better to just keep going. And we all know you like to read. It might not be green eggs and ham, but for number two, always have a hard copy of your script in hand. And I'm on live, but you taped your speech. Last night, you taped it. So here's tip number three, and it's a basic one. Make sure you upload the right clip to YouTube. But you know what else you should start looking over? The rest of the speech. The president tried to paint a rosy picture of an economy that's booming. Let me start over. Stop the train wreck that is Obamacare. Let me start over. Stop the president's illegal and unconstitutional amnesty. Let me start over. I guess 58 straight months of private sector job growth is doom and gloom for the economy? And I guess the uninsured rate at a record low is a train wreck? And that unconstitutional amnesty is actually a very constitutional executive action helping nearly 5 million people. Does Senator Cruz think we wouldn't notice his policy flubs are far worse than his video flub? My response to that is right in that prompter. It says, we got you. Wait, let me start over. We got you.